PipeGuard is the pipeline rehabilitation company of the future. PipeGuard only utilizes the highest quality eco-friendly products available in today's marketplace. Here at PipeGuard, we pride ourselves in being the leader in the advancement of underground rehabilitation technologies and use the most advanced robotic and ultraviolet technology available. When ultraviolet lining of a failed sewer or storm drain is required, bypass of the affluent within the failed line must be completed. PipeGuard has the ability to complete this scope of work in-house. Prior to the installation of any ultraviolet cured reinforced fiberglass liner, the hose pipe will need to be cleaned of any debris. Once the hose pipe has been cleaned, a robotic camera is inserted into the line to assure that the damaged pipe has been properly cleaned of all excess material. After the pipe has been thoroughly inspected and found to be free of any debris, it is ready for the relining process to begin. Prior to the actual liner being installed, a plastic gliding foil measuring 0.5 millimeters in thickness is inserted into the hose pipe by means of a simple pulley system. This gliding foil stretches the entire length of the host pipe and allows the heavier liner to then be pulled into place with ease from manhole to manhole. PipeGuard is a certified installer of BKP Barolina liner. BKP specifically designs each and every liner independently. Every location will have a separate set of criteria that will determine the size and thickness of the structural liner required. BKP delivers all of their liners in specially designed crates, each containing a single length or section of liner for a specific location. The liner is folded in such a fashion that its removal from the crate and into the manhole is achieved with little effort. The end of the liner is secured and easily pulled into position within the manhole. Radio communication is required between both manholes for the lining process to be completed successfully. Once the liner has been inserted into the failed sewer, the ends of the liner are trimmed in order to accept the end cans. The end cans have various hose connections and keep the liner airtight by implementing a strap system that seals the liner to the cans. Once the end cans are secure, an ultraviolet light train is inserted into the liner through an access point within the end of the can itself. The end can is then resealed to the liner and the liner is ready for inflation. The BKP liner is inflated slowly to allow the specially designed overlapping layers of fiberglass to expand tightly to the host pipe. The UV light train comes equipped with a high temperature camera that allows us to inspect the liner before and during the lining process. Once the liner has been inspected throughout its length, the lights on the light train are turned on. The light train assembly is then retracted back through the pipe, curing the liner as it travels. Once this part of the lining process is completed, the light train is then removed from the line pipe through the end can. The end cans are then removed and the excess cured liner is trimmed flush with the end of the pipe, giving it a clean look. Once this segment is complete, the house laterals are robotically reinstated. The sewer is now ready to be put back into service.